Welcome to Unit 11.1, .1, Review of Geometric Solids, Part 1. Today's lesson is going to be all about vocabulary. First, let's talk about geometric solids. Geometric solids are very simply any three-dimensional shape. All of the shapes pictured here are geometric solids. Prism, a 3D shape with two parallel and congruent bases. The side pieces are formed by congruent rectangles. Pyramid, a 3D shape with one polygon for its base. All other side pieces are formed by congruent triangles that meet at the top to form its vertex. Cylinder, a 3D shape with two parallel and congruent circular bases. One curved face is formed around the middle of the shape. Cone, a 3D shape with a circular base and a vertex at its top. Sphere, a 3D shape with no faces and no vertices. Polyhedron, a 3D figure formed by polygons like these triangles and having no holes. Polyhedra is the plural of this word. Now let's talk about all of the parts of a 3D shape. This is a triangular prism. A triangular prism has five faces. One, two, three. This face in the back is four, and the one on the bottom is five. A face is the flat part of a 3D shape. The next part of a 3D shape that we are going to discuss is the edge. This is the place on a 3D shape where two faces come together. This shape has nine edges. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. The final part of a 3D shape that we are going to discuss is called the vertex. This is the place on a 3D shape where three or more faces come together to form a point. It is also known as a corner. This triangular prism has one, two, three, four, five, six vertices. These are all of the parts of a 3D shape. Here is your practice problem for the day. Name this geometric solid. How many surfaces, edges, and vertices does it have? 